Hi, I'm Keisha, the pharmacist on duty. I know that there was a bit of urgency for you. Uh, yes. Thank you for the wait. Okay. Can I help you, please? Yes, you can. So I'm taking warfarin, yes. three milligrams. Okay. So um, when I opened the cups, the tablets, I've been taking them for three days. And just the other day, I noticed that there are different colors okay. from the one I'm used to. Mm -hmm. Then upon a closer inspection, I noticed it said five oh. and not three. So I'm, I'm very concerned. Um, I'm very scared. And I'm very annoyed with mm -hmm. the pharmacy mm -hmm. um, because of what you guys have done. What mm -hmm. are you doing here? Mm -hmm. Like, um, what kind of pharmacy is this? Mm -hmm. uh, there's been a mistake. Mm -hmm. And I've noticed I have bruising and I am having a nosebleed as well every day now. So I don't know what to do. Okay, thank you. Let me have a look at this. Could you okay. please sit in my uh, counseling area? I assure you that what we discussed here will be kept confidential. And first of all, I must apologize for what is happening and I'm going to do a thorough investigation. Okay, but before do. I can do so, I need to ask you a few questions. And the prescription for this warfarin is from Merlin Jones. Yes, that's And me. that's you, Merlin yeah. Jones. Let me just pull up your profile to see what's happening. Oh, you were given warfarin three milligrams, well, I'm right? I'm supposed to be given. You guys didn't give me three, you gave me five. Okay, I'm going to go to check on the medication that you yeah. came back with us for, and then I'll look at the pill identifier and see if it's the right medication that is being prescribed for you, okay? It's not the right medication, it's a different color. Okay, thank you. First of all, you said you're having some bruising and bleeding. Yes. Any updating allergies? No. Any no. other medication you're taking? Uh, no, no other medication. What about uh, the, uh, prescription medication, no um, medical condition like that? No changes. Okay, in no. Any increase in your diet, decrease in your diet or anything with, with uh, any green leaf vitamin, uh, foods or vegetables or anything? Uh, no. Okay, what about your lifestyle and change, alcohol or uh, caffeine? No, I've been, everything has been the same. Same, okay. Yeah. All right, thank you. And you said you're taking two days uh, supply of this medication? Three, three days, days? Yeah. okay. All right, just give me a few minutes. Let me just double check to make sure. Okay, okay. thank you so much. Okay, thank you so much for your wait after verifying and looking at the profile, looking in our literature and I'm sorry, I must apologize, you have been given the wrong strength warfarin, so that's why you right. have been the side effect. Right. Okay, so on behalf of my team here, we apologize for that. However, I'm so happy that you just take three day supply, so we're going to see if we can best correct this mistake. I assure you that this will never happen to you nor any other patient. We'll take all the necessary precaution and steps in when we're dispensing the medication. What I will do, I will have to report it to our uh, Medifec Canada Vigilant Watch and to make a report so it will be reported and documented that this was taken place. I'll also report to the Ontario College of Pharmacy about the report so it's up to you if you want to go ahead and proceed to make a report. But as I said to you before and again we are sorry for this mistake being happening. It should not happen. We have a zero tolerance when it comes on to giving wrong medication to any of our patients. Our patient is priority to us at this time. Okay, so in the meantime based on the side effect that you said you're having, this is of urgency because you have to go back to your doctor so I'm going to send a report to your doctor as well so the doctor should be expecting you to, so you will do more tests for instance your INR to see if there's any change and what you will do with regard to dosing you for the warfarin okay so thank you so much again for picking up on this error and as I said there's no need for this to happen it should have never happened mm -hmm. will never happen again and I will follow up with you and call you about three days okay. to see if you're having any symptoms of the nose bleeding and the same doctor change the medication for you you're welcome and we'll fill the new prescription or any change or adjustment i'm going to make a documentation in your profile and thank you for so being so vigilant and thanks again for coming thank you okay. i'm sorry that's okay I mean, thank you so much for your help Okay, thank you very much. I'm just going to give you a few tips based on the case just discussed. It's warfarin uh, dispensing error. First, I must say in a pharmacy, it's zero tolerance for dispensing error. However, we're human and at times mistakes happen. The first step to do is to acknowledge a mistake is being made. 
then you apologize you have to apologize to your patient letting them know you're sorrowful and it will never happen again and you're taking all possible steps to make sure that it will never happen again you have to document that report and send to the relevant authority and let the patient know that all documentations are being made seek medical attention in this case it is important because the patient and I will have to be measured to determine a decrease or increase in dose in the warfarin and for them to stop the medication so for them not to have any further damage thank you so much I hope this tip was able to help you bye